Today we look at our new power system for Distant Shores 3. We've sailed 3,400 miles since we took delivery of our new Southerly 480 four months ago. With our first shakedown cruise up to London via the River Thames, then south to the Channel Islands and jumping offshore across the Bay of Biscay to Lisbon in Portugal. Then it was a more leisurely sail along the Algarve coast and Spain. Just a few weeks ago we sailed into the Balearic Islands and back out to Gibraltar. Stay tuned for these videos in a week or so. Today we're going to take a close look over our power system. We've been dying to tell you about this. It's now been two years that we've been working on this with a company that's developing it called Triscoll and they are working on a generator replacement technology. So this area in the boat would normally be where the generator is installed just behind the fuel tanks under all of this saloon. Uh, so we're going to go down and take a look at this component of the system which is a huge storage battery bank. So instead of a generator you have to service, uh, it's got a battery bank in here that saves all the power. So part of the reason I didn't want the generator was that it's difficult access to get down into this spot. So what we're seeing in here is the battery bank that is going to be charged by this new generator which is on the engine. So it's going to use spare engine power to charge this 10 kilowatt bank of batteries and then that gives you the equivalent of having a generator available all day as it's topping off the main 12 volt bank. And we'll show you the other component which is over on the front of the engine and then the control system for that. Isn't this shot of the engine cool? It looks so nice because I've got it lit from the bottom uh, which wasn't exactly intentional because I dropped the light so today's filming project becomes trying to retrieve my nifty little uh, light from underneath the engine. So here is the unit bolted on the front of our beautiful Yanmar 4 JH80 horsepower engine and uh, this is the unit right here and it can produce regularly we have seen it producing up to 7 kilowatts which is quite incredible. It's the control system that allows this much power to be safely taken off a normal sailboat engine without overloading it. We felt privileged to work with the team at Triscoll Marine and Nigel Calder on this new technology. As an introduction we'd like to show you the promo video about how this advanced generator replacement system has been working for us. We're Paul and Cheryl Shard, sailing authors and presenters of the Distant Shores Sailing Adventure TV series. We've been documenting our global voyages for the past 30 years and have just taken delivery of our brand new Southerly 480, our ultimate cruising yacht for world expeditions. Most of us want the same kind of stuff on our boats as we have when we're ashore. We want hot meals at sea, civilized toilets, we need to run our laptops to edit our videos, and we expect to have lots of hot water. We want our crew to be happy and clean. Hey, I'm showering in here. In order to deliver the essentials, we need lots of electricity on board. But where does all the power come from? As boaters, we're completely off the grid. We're just an isolated bubble of civilization in a big blue world. There are two practical energy sources at sea. One is solar and the other is diesel. On sailing boats, especially monohulls, solar is limited since we don't have the surface area to collect enough. So our primary source of energy is diesel. We use this both to propel the boat and to produce electricity. This electricity runs all of the facilities and on DS3 we also use it to produce our fresh water. Cheryl and I have fitted generators before and although they've worked, I've always been on the lookout for something better. I want something more up-to-date, simpler to operate, and more environmentally friendly. On Distant Shores 3, we have been running practical trials on a new system that uses the main engine to produce electricity rather than a standalone generator. The Integral system from Triscoll Marine has performed perfectly. The idea behind Integral is simple. For most of the time, the propeller doesn't use all of the energy available from the main engine. 
This new system uses the spare power to generate electricity, so now the engine is doing two things at the same time. It's driving the boat and it's generating electrical power. Smart new technology ensures that the two loads when added together keep the engine operating at its most fuel efficient. One engine, two jobs, less diesel. From our experience, the integral system completely eliminates the need for a separate generator, delivering plentiful power in a simple and efficient manner. Next time on Distant Shores, we set sail from Gibraltar for a Mediterranean cruise to the Balearic Islands. Please give us a thumbs up if you like this video, and don't forget to subscribe to get notice of our upcoming episodes of Distant Shores.